I've always had a strong interest in uh, law enforcement and I actually began as a police explorer back when I turned 14. When it came time to go to college and I learned about Lakeland's criminal justice degree, I actually talked to a lot of people in the field and I noticed that most of them actually have a law enforcement degree from Lakeland. So I decided that that's what I wanted to pursue to help serve the community and you know be involved with people because I'm not a desk job kind of guy. Criminal justice encompasses areas including law enforcement or policing, the court system, and the correction system at the federal, state, and local levels of government. Lakeland's criminal justice program is designed to prepare you with the skills, knowledge, and abilities necessary to pursue careers or professional development in criminal justice. All of our faculty are current or former criminal justice practitioners in their respective fields. And that benefits the students because they bring in real world problems, uh, current issues into the classroom. And here at Lakeland, you're not gonna just be sitting, listening to a lecture, you're going to be doing things. You're gonna be learning by doing. Uh, some of the things that I do in my classroom is I show real life cases that I've worked. I have the students work through those cases and try to solve that case. You're gonna learn how to fingerprint. You're gonna learn how to cast footwear impressions. Uh, you're gonna learn how to conduct a homicide investigation from the initial crime scene all the way into the arrest of the offender. Um, you're going to do all those practical things which is going to prepare you for the real world. There are actual skills I've picked up from these classes, such as the interview and interrogation class or the crisis intervention class. I learned skills that I apply to the street when talking to mentally ill people or handicapped people. Crisis intervention has helped immensely. But some of the other classes, such as current issues in criminal justice and stuff like that, doesn't necessarily provide you with direct skills that you can take onto the field but it gives you a different way of thinking things and it kind of creates you to be more open-minded and say, you know, I'm, I'm investigating this crime, but is there a different way I should be looking at this? Once you finish your associate's degree here at Lakeland, there's two possibilities. One is you go directly to the police academy and the other opportunity is you can go to the Holden University Center where you can obtain your bachelor's degree and also your master's degree. Now my plans next is to go over uh, across the street to the Holden Center to get my bachelor's from Youngstown and Lakeland and Youngstown have partnered where you can do three years here and then just one year at the Holden Center at um, Youngstown's price. So I've done you know, my three years here, so I'll just have a year um, over at the Holden Center so, to get my bachelor's. I feel so comfortable that when I start the police academy, I don't think it'll be a hard endeavor for me. I get phone calls every semester from agencies looking for Lakeland graduates because they know they're well prepared. What you learn here at Lakeland is going to help you in your job and you'll be like, oh yeah, I remember. We talked about that in class. So it's very much um, appropriate for right now and to get into the field that you need to go into. Employment opportunities are excellent and are expected to grow well into the future. We're always going to need people employed in the criminal justice system. Uh, and it's not only in police work, it's also in the court system and it's in corrections. You have opportunities to be bailiffs, uh, you could be a probation officer, you could be a parole officer, you can work with victims and be a victim's advocate. So there's many opportunities out there uh, other than just working as a, as a patrol officer. Any field in public service because the criminal justice degree isn't just about teaching you to be a police officer, you know, that's what we have our police academies for, but it teaches you different ways of thinking and how to serve the community. And there's so many other community service and government jobs out there that isn't just law enforcement, but directed at helping people, you know, as a whole.